We wanted to begin a conversation around this whole concept of recruiting and outreach to student or scholar athletes into science and health professions. The conversation started around a severe shortage of black and Latino males in science and medicine and expanded into a conversation around the larger student body of athletes. Me and my mom were interested in coming here because we were looking for different opportunities for me in the future. Student athletes have confidence, self-discipline, time management. These are all things that are critically important to be successful as a researcher and a scientist. You already have it. Well, I think it's really important that kids can see people like them succeed and knowing that they can go do athletics and pursue medicine and other careers in healthcare. It's nice to see people like myself and like our peers get there. One of the hardest things I struggled with was probably mentorship, finding people that went through the same things, that had the same aspirations, and I think this kind of summit gives you so many opportunities to talk to people that go through the same thing. Hosting an event uh, like this summit is really important to make sure that everyone who wants to enter the medical field feels like that they have someone they can look up to and model off of. Being able to see people who came from sports and seeing the different things that they're doing outside of sports is definitely something that's eye-opening, and I think my students and scholars could all benefit from that. After hearing the presentation, I feel like you can be a good student and a good athlete at the same time. If you put as much work as to either side, I think you can be great. If they can do it, we can do it as well. What are the opportunities to work with the athletics directors, the coaches, the advisors, to really create an environment and culture that says you could be successful at both? It's not a choice between sports in academics. You can really do both and if we foster that in middle school, high school, and then we find a way to really work collaboratively between athletics and academics in college, we really think the culture change can happen. Folks who are athletes have attributes that will allow them to be successful professionals in all spheres, but particularly in STEM careers and in medicine. The primary thing that I, I hope that they got was that they can do it, that it's possible. And the second thing is that we want them, that there's actually an opportunity for them. So we're looking for young people who are hardworking, are motivated, who have grit, or who are team players, who are leaders. And those are young people who have been athletes their whole lives. The gap between academics and athletics should not be far. It is our responsibility to create the opportunities for the student athletes to participate in research to get the coaching that they need to be successful in their academic pursuits. People try to tell you that you can't do things because they can't do it themselves and when you have a dream you have to protect it. Hearing the students, athletes' experiences, they gave me a lot of motivation, brought my hopes up. It just told me that anything is possible if you just put your mind to it. Programs like Mount Sinai is actually looking for these types of students, looking for them. And I think that's the message that uh, we wanted them to leave with today. Thank you.